today in this video we will see how to calculate hemming code it is very simple to calculate the hemming code so hemming code calculation of the hemming code calculation of hemming code for error detecting and correcting now let us uh, take one example so this is the example for us that is 1 double zero 1000 we can say d1 is equal to 1 d2 is equal to 0 d5 is equal to 0 and d7 is equal to 0 so normally in hemming code 7 bit input are there and 4 bit is the redundant bit that is uh, called as the redundant bit so 7 plus 4 is equal to uh, 11 bit in short Hemming code having the 7 bit input and output is equal to 11 bit out of 11 bit 7 bit for the uh, data bit and 4 bit will be redundant bit here what is our job our job is to calculate the redundant bit and complete the Hemming code of 11 bits so take an example as we know out output will be 11 bit so we draw the 11 box over here and uh, first bit means first uh, index is always 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 11. So that is called as the index. Now we will calculate the position of R1, R2, R3 and R4 where R stand for redundant bit. So 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 and it is referred to as the R1. 2 raised to 2 uh, ref, uh, is equal to 4 and it is referred to as the redundant bit. 3 2 raised to 3 is equal to 8 and it is called as the r4 so what whatever the value we get over here it is the position of respective redundant bit so we can say that r1 uh, the position of the r1 is equal to 1 because here we get the 1 so i can say this is the uh, r1 is equal to 1 so that is the r1 then after R2 is equal to 2, so that is the 2 and it is the position of the R2. R3 is equal to 4, so that is the 4 and R4. And last R4 is equal to 8, so here we write the R4. So that is the position of the R1 to R4 and it is fixed right now. And rest of the position will be used for the redundant bit, sorry data bit and data bit D1 and it will be in sequence so d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 and d7 put the value of uh, element into the box so we can say that the value of d1 is equal to 1 so we write the 1 over here because the value 1 given uh, in the example then d2 is equal to 0 so d2 is equal to 0, d3 is equal to 0, then after d4, 5, 6 and 7, that is the 1, 0, 0 and 0. Everything is given up to now. Now what is our job? To find the value of R1, R2, R3 and R4 and complete the 11 bit output. So now how to calculate and how to get it? It is very simple. Uh, suppose what is over here 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 so where the d1 to 7 is given to you so i can say this is the 1 uh, this is the 2 it is uh, leave it because those are the redundant bit so leave the field of the redundant bit and calculate the further processing on the data bit value so we are leaving this one this one this one and the uh, r R4 and uh, calculate the D1 so I want to make the 3 so how it is possible 3 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 and to, uh, using the redundant bit uh, calculate the 3 or make 3 using the uh, using this table so how it is possible 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 and 2 raised to 1 is equal to 2 so I can say uh, I can say that 2 raised to 0 plus 2 raised to 1 means 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 
and 2 raised to 1 is equal to 2 and 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 our job is to make the 3 make sure it is always uh, uh, required the summation means 2 plus 1 or 4 plus 1 1 plus 4 don't use uh, negative addition or uh, minus means 2 4 minus 1 3 don't use minus let us go ahead and uh, see the next more uh, what we want to build that is the 5 and uh, 5 is possible using the 4 and plus so 2 raised to 0 and 2 raised to 2 means 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 2 raised to 2 is equal to 4 and 1 plus 4 is equal to 5 leave the position of the redundant bit now one more example 6 so 6 is possible using the 2 plus 4 means 2 raised to 1 and 2 raised to 2 2 raised to 1 and 2 raised to 2 is equal to uh, 2 plus 4 is equal to 6 now 7 7 means 2 raised to 0 2 raised to 1 2 raised to 2 4 plus 2 plus 1 means 7 so 2 raised to 0 plus 2 raised to 1 plus 2 raised to 2 is equal to 7 leave the position of the redundant bit so we are leaving it then 9 9 is possible using the 2 raised to 3 and 2 raised to 0 2 raised to 0 plus 2 raised to 3 is equal to uh, 2 plus sorry 1 plus 8 is equal to 9 then after make the value of 10 or 10 so for uh, 8 plus 2 uh, 8 plus 2 means 2 raised to 1 and 2 raised to 3 is equal to 2 plus 8 is equal to 10 and finally for the last field 11 so uh, 8 plus 2 plus 1 means 2 raised to 0 plus 2 raised to 1 plus 2 raised to 3 means 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 8 8 plus 2 10 and 11 so this is the thing now we want to calculate the value of d1 d2 up to d7 uh, so for that write the formula or how to create or uh, generate the formula that is the uh, let us take it is the m m1 or simple r1 is equal to r1 is equal to now what is the value of r1 right now that is the 1 so where 1 and we use a, a 0 for the r1 see it is very simple here we need to calculate the r1 and we know that r1 is, means 2 raised to 0 that is the given over here so where the 2 raised to g1 is, uh, is used so here here d same uh, uh, d4 here and here 1 2 3 4 and 5 there are total 5 locations where 2 raised to 0 is used so find its position means d1 then d2 then d4 d5 plus d7 d7 d1 d2 d4 d5 and d7 now put the value in a box or put the value of d1 what is the value of d1 you can also use that table d1 the value of d1 is equal to 1 d2 d4 d2 0 d4 1 0 plus 1 plus and the rest of the bits are 0 plus 0 means here always use we need to use the xor xor for the addition so 1 plus 1 is equal to always 0 don't use carry so that is the value of r1 now do the same process for the r2 so here we write the r2 and what is the formula for r2 that is the 2 raised to 1 find where the 2 raised to 1 is used in an entire table or in a above part 2 raised to 1 because r2 uh, indicate the 2 raised to 1 so is it a 2 raised to 1 yes it is 2 raised to 1 then another 2 raised to 1 2 raised to 1 2 raised to 1 and 2 raised to 1 it means there are total 5 locations where 2 raised to 1 is used one is the d1 then d3 then after d4 d9 and last one is the d11 now add and put the value and make the xor the value of d1 is equal to 1 d3 d3 is equal to 0 you can also use that table uh, d4 again it is the 1 and d9 and d11 d9 
sorry d9 uh, d4 then there is a one mistake uh, d9 no d5 d5 and uh, sorry sorry uh 2 raised to 1 means 2 raised to 1 we are last at d4 then d6 and finally d7 now add the value means d6 what is the value of d6 value of d6 is equal to 0 and uh, d7 what is the value of d7 again it is the 0 means we get 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 so the value of r2 again 0 then after calculate same for r3 r3 and what we use for r3 r3 2 raised to 2 so 2 raised to 2 find where the 2 raised to 2 is used so we can say 2 raised to 2 uh, that is the first location second location third location is there any one um, more location for the 2 raised to no so write the uh, d2 d3 and d4 d2 d3 plus d4 because where the value d2 uh, 2 raised to 2 is used now put the value in a box the value of d2 d3 and d4 d2 d3 and d4 means 0 plus 1 0 plus d2 d3 and d1 0 plus 0 plus 1 is equal to 1 and that is the r3 now the final calculation final calculation for the r4 r4 2 raised to 3 and uh, where is the 2 raised to 3 in our structure 2 raised to 3 2 raised to 3 and 2 raised to 3 and 1 2 raised to 3 means we can set at d5 d6 and d7 write the d5 d6 and d7 put the value of d5 d6 and d7 that is the all zero means zero plus zero plus zero is equal to zero so that is the r4 now put the value of r1 into the its box so r1 value that is the zero r2 value that is the 0 r3 value that is the 1 and r4 is equal to 0 so we can say that the hamming code hamming code for this input is the out is or will be like that output 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 0 0 0 repeat 1 double 0 double 1 double 0 double 1 double 0 1 0 double 0 1 0 1 0 and triple 0 now calculate 2 plus 2 4 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 out of them the bit value first 2 bit then this bit value and finally one uh, that is those are the redundant bit those are the redundant bit and the rest of the bits are the data bit so that is our output in short if you like this video then do like and share thank you very much